Ceramics and Science by Jack Conway. Did you know Tom Cruise wore ceramic braces? How about the great golfer Jack Nicklaus has a ceramic hip? Ceramics is a concept most people think of as an ancient or just an outdated art. Little do they know, ceramics is alive and well, not only in creating art, but advancing the world as we know it. A wide range of ceramic materials are being used in the science and medical fields worldwide. Medical fields such as dentistry, surgery, bodily replacements, and countless more have had advancements largely in recent years. In the future, ceramics will find applications in gene therapy and tissue engineering. From as large as the heat-resistant protective tiles on the outside of space shuttles that can withstand 3,000 degrees Fahrenheit, to the small needles used in a diabetic's insulin pump, ceramics is playing a role to most people never thought would be possible in the world we live in. Ceramic tiles are used in our country's space shuttles. The thermal protection system on shuttles is the shuttle's largest defense to the heat encountered during the re-entry into the Earth's atmosphere from outer space. The shuttle must be able to withstand extreme temperatures and air deflections while coming back in. Every time the shuttle enters the atmosphere, it loses several of these ceramic tiles. But as long as they don't all come off in one spot, the shuttle will be okay. These tiles are made of ceramic materials that can withstand temperatures of 3,000 degrees Fahrenheit. There are over 27,000 of these tiles on each shuttle. Each one just as important as the one next to it. If a few of them fail, the shuttle will melt in that spot and then cause a domino effect, melting the whole aircraft, thus making the whole shuttle and its crew doomed. Dental hygiene is one of the last places I thought I would find the use for ceramics. In fact, the role of ceramic crowns and ceramic fillings is close to a major role. Teeth can be filled with gold, silver, porcelain, and now ceramic material. Ceramic fillings are generally much more resilient and less likely to crack or wear out compared to their metal counterparts. That means that there is less likelihood you have to get your tooth filled again costing you more time and money. The ceramic material used in fillings can last more than 15 years. Not surprisingly, ceramic fillings require a smaller size of the tooth needed for the filling. That means more of your actual tooth structure would remain just the way it is with the ceramic filling. For those who don't like the dentist drilling, this serves as a great benefit. Dentistry has advanced so much it is possible to match a patient's natural tooth color with other applicants for improving a patient's smile. Advancements are so incredible, the size, shape, and even color of the natural tooth can be reconstructed out of ceramic material and made to fit perfectly in the actual tooth spot. You can't even tell you had an operation on your smile. Now that's something to smile about. Ceramics in the health field has affected my family personally. Research in juvenile diabetes, to be more specific, my sister has type 1 diabetes. The advancements in the insulin pump has greatly helped her life. The ceramic upgrades in the actual pump include sharper and stronger and more reliable needles. The needles also last longer than typical stainless steel needles. That way she has to change infusion sets less often and with less pain. All in all, ceramic advancements have made and will continue to make life a little more awesome for us in the near future.